Hello my lovely readers, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to read Peppa Pig. Peppa is kind. Let's read. It was well-being week at playgroup and Madame Gazelle was talking about feelings with the children. What feeling does this picture show? She asked, holding up a smiley face. Happy or sad? Happy, called the children. And this one, she asked, holding up a frowny face. Sad, replied the children. Very good, said Madame Gazelle. It is important we know what we are feeling and what others are feeling too. At playtime, Peppa and Zuzi Sheep were playing a game. I won! shouted Peppa. No, I won! shouted Zuzi. How are you feeling right now, Peppa? asked Madame Gazelle. Angry! said Peppa. I won! How are you feeling right now, Zuzi? asked Madame Gazelle. Angry! said Zuzi. I won! Madame Gazelle asked everyone what Peppa and Zuzi should do. They should both be winners and say sorry for shouting, said Edmund Elephant. Wonderful suggestion, Edmund, said Madame Gazelle. Let's see what happens. Then they both say sorry at the same time. One, two, three... Sorry, said Peppa and Zushi. I feel much better now, said Peppa. I don't feel angry anymore. Me too, said Sushi. I feel happy again. Very good, said Madame Gazelle. If you have an argument with someone, stop and think about why you feel angry or upset. And think about how the other person is feeling too. Peppa and Sushi went out to the playground to play with their skipping ropes. Mandy Mouse was playing with a bouncy ball. Can I play bouncy ball with you, Mandy? asked Danny Dog. Bounce, bounce, bounce. Mandy was having lots of fun with the ball and she wanted to keep bouncing it all by herself. No, said Mandy. You can play with it later instead. That's not nice, said Candy Cat. Danny looks sad. Madame Gazelle asked Danny and Mandy how they were feeling. I feel sad because I can't play, said Danny. I feel sad that Danny's sad, said Mandy. What does everyone think Mandy should do, asked Madame Gazelle. Shia, cheered the children. Mandy shared the ball with Danny. They both felt happy. After lunch, the children played hopscotch together. George fell over and hurt her leg. He started to cry. Oh, poor George, I know how he feels, said Pedro Pony. I have hurt my leg before. If we know how others are feeling, said Madame Gazelle. Then we can help them. Can I help George up? asked Peppa. Of course, Peppa, said Madame Gazelle. That's very kind of you. When we are kind, it makes others feel happy. And it makes us feel happy too. I like feeling happy, said Rebecca Rabbit. Me too, everyone cheered. Now, children, said Madame Gazelle, I have a little game for you. I call it my one kind thing game. To play, you have to do one, ki one kind thing for someone, then ask that person to do one kind thing for someone else. Ooh, said the children. The kind thing doesn't have to be big, just something that will make another person feel happy. 
explained Madame Gazelle. Peppa, George and their friends told their families about the one kind thing game. What a lovely idea, Mummy Pig said to Peppa. Can we help you with some shopping, Mummy? asked Peppa. Yes, that would be very kind, said Mummy Pig, feeling happy. Then afterwards, will you please do one kind thing for someone else? asked Peppa. Of course, said Mummy Pig. So, Mummy Pig did one kind thing for Daddy Pig. Daddy Pig did one kind thing for Granny Pig. Granny Pig did one kind thing for Grandpa Pig. And Grandpa Pig did one kind for Miss Rabbit. Soon everyone was doing one kind thing for someone else. Danny gave his mommy a flower. Mommy dog made Granddad dog chuckle. Soy Zebra helped Mr. Zebra post letters. Mr. Zebra gave Mrs. Zebra a present. Mrs. Zebra taught Zaza and Zuzi Zebra to make pottery. Zaza and Zuzi gave their pottery to Mrs. Rabbit. Edmund found Emily Elephant's toy mouse. Emily played the recorder for Mommy Elephant. Mommy Elephant found Dr. Elephant his football boots. When they went back to playgroup, Peppa and her friends were excited to tell Madame Gazelle about their kind deeds. What wonderful kind things, children, said Madame Gazelle. Perhaps we should play the one kind thing game every day. Yes, everyone cheered. At playtime, Peppa and Zuzi both wanted to play with the skipping rope. It's my turn said Peppa. No, it's not, said Susie. It's my turn. One, two, three. Sorry, said Peppa and Susie. Let's keep together with everyone, said Peppa. Yes, cheered Susie. What a lovely kind play group we have, said Madame Gazelle. Peppa loves being kind. Everyone loves being kind. So, be kind to everyone, my children. Thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoy it. There will be more coming soon. So look out for the next one. And please subscribe. See you soon. Bye-bye. Booktube Kids